Hey guys, this is how to make your iPod Touch um look like it's running on a uh, actual. This is carrier, like AT and T or T Mobile. Those are the two you get from the USA, and you can get more than that. Um, the website listed in the description. Um, hold on, I'm booting it up right now. Looks like this. This iPhone Help Center. This is meant for the iPhone for tethering. Let me press tethering right here. Oh, sorry. Click tethering. And I'll put a disclaimer. If you read this, this must read first. It says it. You use this service and config files on your own risk. Then M dot app only offers a pure config configurations. Please know and respect the I, the iPhone contracts. And now you can scroll down to whatever country you're in. I'm going to check the USA. As you can see, there's AT&T and T-Mobile. It's going to open up a new window, and yet again, it's going to say all this. You can choose to install web clips or not, which is just more stuff and your more info. You download it. And pops up another window. Install profile. AT&T unsigned. AT&T again. AT&T again. Um, dash pin m pin bin m dot at received June 27th 2010. Contains APN. And then your more info at option has this. Advanced settings name WAP dot singular. Username WAP at singular gprs.com. Go ahead and press install. This is all done on your iPod Touch or iPhone. Unsigned profile. Installing this profile will change settings on your iPod. Install now or cancel. Now, since I already have this installed on my device, this profile failed to install. Only your APN configurations can be installed at this time. So now if I go to my settings, go to general, actually I'm not running at and I am running um, the setup on how to make your own, which I'm going to be teaching in a few seconds, as you see, my name. Now all you have to do is go to your profile, and move. This is remove profile. Removing this profile will change settings on your iPod. Remove or cancel. I'm going to press remove and it's removing the profile. Now it's done. And I have no more profile on this. Now I'm going to be teaching you what to do, how to create one, and what to do if you have a passcode already enabled on your iPod. Now, for informational purposes and for this video, my password is just Black Rain. So B L A C K R A one N. Okay. Now I'm gonna be going into my folder. I'm running iOS 4.0. As you can see, it's going to be opening up. Back into tethering. 
and go all the way down to create your own generator. As you see, as you can see, it's going to say important. You create your own multi multiple config, mobile config at your own risk. Make sure you use the correct car carrier data and tap the download button. The web clip is optional, not required. Now, carrier name. I'm going to be using capture just because in this corner over here. My recording software is capture, and I just seen that first. APN, I'm trying to pay my website. HTTP. Um, www. Um, Magical. Curries. Dot. Webs. Dot. Com. Forward slash user place actually everything password whatever you want it to be mine's gonna be space actually it's gonna be black right again it doesn't have to be your actual pass password it just that's what I'm choosing now as you can see it does say web clips on or off I must have clicked um, I must have clicked install on accident or download one of the two. As you can see, it's going to open up your install profile, capture, capture, unsign, install description, capture, dash, bin, m, dot, at, received June 27, 2010, contains APN web clip. More details. APN advanced settings. Name, www.http, um, colon, forward slash, forward slash, www dot, magical carries dot web dot com forward slash user everyone username everyone web clips url h will help dot venom dot at label help center i'm going to press install unsigned profile installing this profile will change settings on your iPod go ahead and press install now now it's going to open up you need your password to enter so b l e c k r a Installing profile. Profile installed. Press done. This will pop you, take you back to your settings and allow you to go to your profile and press capture. And then you can move it the same way. It'll ask for your passcode again. And now there's no longer a passcode. Well, there's no longer um, a profile on your iPod Touch. And went ahead and show you I am running iPhone OS 4.0 or iOS 4 on an iPod Touch second generation MC model. Actually, it's third generation, but it's eight gigabyte. So I, Apple's stupid self, counts that as a um, second gen MC model, and version 4.0. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.